Good day everyone. Today we are going to discuss illustrating an experiment, outcome, sample space, and event. The goal in this lesson is to learn and understand how to illustrate an experiment, outcome, sample space, and event which would help you in your daily life in making decisions. So let's start with the definition of terms. We have here experiment. Experiment is an activity involving chance that can have different results. It is a process that, when performed, results in exactly one of many observations. Activities such as tossing or flipping a coin rolling a die, or picking a card from a standard deck of cards without looking, which could be repeated over and over again, and which have well-defined results. And next, we have outcomes. Outcomes are the results of experiments. If you are flipping a coin, head and tail are the possible outcomes. Sample space. Sample space is a set of all possible outcomes of an experiment and is denoted by S. You are flipping a coin. Once, head and tail are the possible outcomes. Sample space is S is equal to head and tail. The next one we have here, sample point. Sample point is an individual outcome in the sample space. It is one of the possible outcomes. The next one we have here, event. Event is a set of some elements or outcomes of an experiment. It is a subset of sample space. It is not necessary to be the actual in outcome of the experiment. Here are some illustrative examples. Example number one, we have here the situation. You need to get a number 6 in rolling a die to win in the game of snake and ladder. We have here the experiment. The experiment is rolling a die once. The possible outcomes could be these numbers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Because when you throw a die, these are the possible outcomes. So the sample space are all the possible outcomes we have here all the possible outcomes and the event an even number two four and six okay so this is the first example we have here example number two jen and jan are playing cards jan needs to draw a card number five to win the game from a well shuffled Numbered 5, 8, 9, 2, 7 cards and placed face down on the table. So our experiment here is drawing a card. Possible outcomes could be 5, 8, 9, 2, and 7. And the sample space are all the possible outcomes. 5, 8, 9, 2, and 7. The event is a prime number, 2, 5, and 7. Let's proceed to example number 3. Getting an odd die, getting an odd number when you roll a fair die once. The experiment is rolling a fair die once. Possible outcomes, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. And the sample space is all the possible outcomes, and the event is an odd number. Let's proceed to example number four. Spinning a spinner with colors red, blue, green, and yellow, Anna hopes it lands on red. We have the experiment spinning a spinner. The possible outcomes are red. Blue, green, and yellow. Sample space are all the possible outcomes. Red, blue, green, and yellow. And the event lands on non-yellow. 
Now let's proceed to example number five. So we have here the situation. You wish to select a 23-year-old driver randomly from all ra all drivers in the age category of 18 to 25. So this experiment is selecting a driver. Possible outcomes, the ages, 18 to 25, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Sample space are all the possible outcomes and the event is a non teenage driver. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, you may comment down below.